what is going on everybody welcome back to another video today it is the top five best upgrades to do to your e36 to make the thing look brand spanking new let's go ahead and start off with number five Coming in at number five is headlights. Now, as prominent as headlights are to make a car look new, over time they fade from clear to yellow. So one thing you can do is upgrade them to some new ones. Now, lucky for E36s, they are readily available online, specifically eBay, for about $90. Now, this upgrade makes a huge difference in the front look of the car and takes years off of it. Following it up at number four are new hood and trunk badges. Yes, now this might seem so insignificant at first, however, makes a world of a difference in being so cheap and easily installable as they are, you will definitely wanna grab a set for your E36. So we are gonna go ahead and hop on over to eBay once again. Now these range from anywhere around $10 to $45, depending on which ones you go with. Also make sure to double check the sizing of your hood and your trunk badges based on your model year. Now, hopping into the interior for number three is a new steering wheel. Now, instead of reupholstering your old one, go ahead, hop on eBay, buy an E36 M3 Euro steering wheel for about $300, $350, and boom, that will make the interior of your car look so much newer just with one simple modification. And it'll even better your driving experience with being the thing that you touch the most in the car. It will be worth the money. And something I'm gonna tag along with that is a new shift knob. Hop on eBay, you see these things are so cheap. Now, the quality is not the best, but $10 for a shift knob, even shift boots you can't beat it sliding us into number two is window tint for your e36 now these cars are old either a they did not come with tint or b it's old and crusty so slap it on some fresh tint that might run you a couple hundred dollars will go a long way preserving your interior keeping the heat down and making the car look and feel a lot better from the inside if you live in a state where window tint is regulated make sure to be careful with it and not get yourself in trouble and bringing us home for number one is none other than new fresh paint. Now recently I was working on my E36 restoring this thing. I paid $400 for this thing and I recently finished painting it. Now this is my first paint job I've ever done on a car and honestly it came out really really nicely for what it was. Now this was a huge learning experience for me. I learned so so much and the next paint job I do will be even better. But I want to show you guys what the end result was. Enjoy. Well, there you have it everybody that is going to wrap up the five top best mods to do to your e36 to make them look new if you want me to do one of these videos over best drift mods for an e36 make sure to let me know down in the comments below i have plenty of experience getting to know these chassis and sliding them around don't forget to hit the subscribe and the thumbs up also comment down below what modifications you're going to do to your e36 to make it look brand new this is probably my favorite chassis i've ever had we got to keep them alive everybody make sure to save them all make sure to check out the barn find stickers down in the description pick one up for yourself thank you guys so much for watching Catch you guys in the next one.